to Rome. So excited to be here. I have only been here before when I was um, 16 years old, I think, on a school trip. Now I'm going to explore it uh, with a local from Rome and I think it's gonna be much fun. <laughs> can see it. Five years old. It's all over my face. And it's melting. And it's super good. Where are we going now? Uh, Villa Borghese. Villa Borghese. Okay, let's go. animals that, are in, that live in a park like birds and rabbits but this is new hey. next to me as you've probably seen him in the video already is uh, my friend Pietro he flies, the, <laughs> he flies the Airbus 380 and it's actually, you're, my only, you're the only person I know, like personally, who flies long haul. So it's nice to, nice. if I ask you some questions and we can share it with everybody, no? Yeah, also, because I got some questions on my... What kind of questions do you get? 
like how I became pilot and so yeah, like how did you out. become a pilot? Okay, so in Italy I was attending aviation high school, mm. which is like normal high school with some aviation subject on the last three years. Oh, that's good. And part of this uh, education it required to to get the first flight solo, which is like after 12 hours. Oh, really? So that's uh, and that what I did in Rome. Then after that we were uh, with my classmate. We were like, and also with the support of the school, we were uh, researching for flight school and training, and we ended up all in Florida. And yeah, the training was quite good. One of the best time of my life. Yeah. Where I made great friends. We are still in touch, and they are like brothers. How much time did it take? Uh, did you spend in Florida to become well? I certified? stayed there two years, but we did the training in seven, eight months. Okay, it was quite fast and intense. Uh, yeah, then my friends stayed and did the instructor rating. Uh, they got a job as instructor, and I decided to leave for personal reason. Uh, it was actually the best thing because I started to study for my conversion to JAA at that time. The European uh, Aviation Authority. Yeah, so I did my amazing 14 exam, mm -hmm. never ever again. And, Been uh, there, done that. <laughs> and uh, after that I got my 23 hours flight to, to be able to convert those licenses. I got my ATPL Frozen J and then I start to apply for companies and it was the worst time ever. To How much get a time job. did it take you to find your first job? It took me two years to fly it as an airline It was pilot. a difficult time, huh? It That's was a... the worst yeah. because it was like a lot of pilots. No one was uh, hiring unless you had 500 hours on type, yeah. which is like, how That's can you? That's the difficult thing, especially in aviation. Sometimes it, sometimes there's a high demand in pilots, sometimes there's too many. Yeah. And if you're unlucky and you're in a period where there's too many pilots and you don't have any experience at all, it's really difficult to find a job. Yeah. But finally you did. Finally, I reached that uh, right seat. On the Airbus uh, A320. Yes. Thanks to uh, Freebird and Honoré, I always thank to them. Uh, it was an amazing time, amazing training, friendly people, uh, and I really enjoyed Istanbul. I miss Istanbul. Yeah. Uh, I spent five years in Turkey and it was a really good time. So Shikula. it's nice because you can actually uh, compare the short haul operation with the long haul because you've been in both. Yeah. Types of operation. What do you prefer? Uh, honestly, long haul. Yeah. I mean, it's a more. The lifestyle is a bit better. Mm -hmm. uh, short haul was a lot of daily work. You know, yeah. Like, How is your roster more or less? In uh, the current company. Yeah. Like we get depends from the flight. I'm not doing much long haul recently. We get like four or five flights a month and it varying like with uh, let's say if we have too long go which like last month I did Los Angeles and New York nice then I got Mauritius which is one of my favorite destinations yeah and Rome uh, so, so that was like home. quite <laughs> yeah that's the best you can ask him so and do you have time when you get to a destination? Do you have time to actually explore a bit of the city or country? Yeah, yeah, of course. You have like, uh, if you go to Los Angeles, usually we have 48 hours layover. Oh, wow. So, yeah, we arrive in the afternoon, like, let's say, like 4, yeah, 4 p.m. So by, by the time you're, you reach the hotel, it's 4 p.m. Nice. And then, yeah, you go for dinner. And let's see if the crew is willing to do something, you join the crew. That's nice. Yeah, that's, it's important yeah. to have. And then you have all day after, and you can do your other things, explore the city. Nice. Which, which is your favorite destination? Mauritius, you yeah, say? Yeah, Mauritius and Rome. 
Yeah. That's the best. Rome, so, I can imagine, because you have your family and friends. Yeah, we got 24 hours layover, which is amazing for me, you know. So we arrive, leave the things at the hotel, go for dinner with my parents, enjoy my dog, mm -hmm. uh, my friends, and then come back and That's really rest good. for the flight. So, yeah, it's perfect. I love it. How long is the longest flight that you that you perform within your current company with the 380? It was uh, 16 hours to Los Angeles. Yeah. 16 hours? Yeah, it was. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but also, it's like, okay, it's, it's a bit. Okay, we don't fly for 16 hours. Mm -hmm. We have two sets of crew. Oh, just okay. two captain, two first officer. <laughs> and if you are operating, which means you fly, you are operating the flight, so you fly the first half of the flight, and then you go in the bank. In the crew rest compartment and rest for the for the other uh, half okay. and one hour before landing you 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 wake up you change you go back to the cockpit you prepare the aircraft and land and that's, that's amazing you know like it's, uh... this moment i think you already uh, visited a lot of countries in the world what is your top favorite place in the world if you could choose any <laughs> sure yeah. Mauritius. Of Mauritius. Course. I love Mauritius. <laughs> and no. we're back to the beginning. <laughs> we're back to the beginning. So thank you so much for answering my questions. Thank Let's you. Let's continue now our lovely picnic in the park. Sorry and for my thing. I'm a bit shy to do this. But, you know, <laughs> no problem. I'm not really social. And thanks to the followers that I got and to you and all the amazing pictures and comments and tag and thanks a lot. Good. I really hope you liked the video. Um, don't forget to put the thumbs up. Can you do the thumbs up? Thumbs up underneath this video. Um, hope to see you next week and um, follow him on Instagram, Pitpilot1984. Right? Ciao. Ciao.